Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me if I reach one person and one person alone, which I know I will. Please and thank you. All right, all right, all right. Let's go ahead and ground. And I was like, just sitting here about to record. And I was like, Spirit, what is this about? And then all I got, all I got, I was like, I got greens, beans, potatoes, tomatoes, lamb, champ, chicken, hog, mom, you name it. So it's about to be a season of your life, baby. But you have everything you've ever desired, everything you've ever hoped for, everything you've always wanted, and everything you always deserve. You are walking into that season of your life where you just name it, okay? And your manifestations will just be falling down as you say them because you're very loyal, but you're very genuine. Because most importantly, you follow what your intuition is telling you and you follow the most high, right? You're, you're, you're not a person that's going to waver from that. You're not a fake, phony, false person. But you you see, like, as you put your how you put your energy out there, that's who you are, okay? People may have tried to come into your energy trying to say that you were a certain way that you were not. But that is who you are. You are genuine. You are loving. You are this individual, okay? So now I just got that you have everything. Everything is everything, okay? Everything that you've always wanted, you've always it's coming towards you. Yes, baby. Absolutely wonderful energy. And look what I cut the deck on. Cut the deck right on magician. You are this powerful manifester. Everything that you want is here for you. All you got to do is ask for it. All you got to do is be faithful. All you got to do is have that faith. All you got to do is listen to your intuition. And you're doing that, baby. You're doing that. Okay. I have the five of pentacles. You had to let go of something. You had to let go of something to get to this ten of pentacles. Okay. Everybody could not come with you. Okay. Every, and you realize that. You had to cut some situations off. You had to be like, okay, I see how your energy is. Okay. I don't need any repeated patterns. I'm going to leave you where you at. Okay. Then you moved on. And as you moved on, you're in your ten of pentacles season. Okay. Your wealth, your happiness, everything, everything, everything. Okay. So... I'm just so excited because it's just absolutely wonderful energy. Absolutely wonderful energy. We have the Ace of Pentacles that came out with the Two of Pentacles. So there's going to be a lot of opportunities that you're going to be like, it's going to be, you're going to have to get your time management in order. Because there's going to be a lot of things that you've been wanting to do and it's going to feel like it's coming all at once. But it don't matter because you have the strength. You know how to just like, you know, you've been wanting this for a long time. So it ain't going to be no problem. Got to get on up. Yeah. It ain't going to be problem, no problem with you getting up. Okay. It's not going to be any problem with you taking advantage of these opportunities to the full force. Okay. So it's, it's a lot of things. It's like. Um, you have new job opportunities. You have um, gifts that you have been um, given. And as you give those gifts, um, there's a lot of things that are coming towards you, right? There's a lot of prosperity coming towards you. This is going to be the most secure time of your life. And it's just gonna, you're going to just be able to keep on building upon that. It's everything, right? It's absolutely everything. And then what else do we have? We have the Knight of Pentacles, okay? So it's like there's going to be some type of change here. There's going to be some type of change of your routine. Like I was just saying, you're going to be very busy. Whereas you may have had a business before where you were not as busy. It's about to pick up. It's about to pick up tremendously, okay? Just remember um, that you have what it takes. Like you've been wanting this for a long time. So even whenever you feel like you're tired, even when you feel like, um, you know, a lot of things um, are maybe overwhelming to you, you know you've been wanting this. So you'll be able to just reach out to the most high and ask for advice, ask for assistance, and you'll be able to go ahead and do what you're led to do. And as you're doing what you're led to do, it's nothing but abundance. You're learning lessons. Page of Pentacles here. You're getting good news. Um, you're you're having new financial opportunities here. And it's like everything from your past, um, all the nostalgic memories, all of the kindness, all of the good things from your past. Not none of those mag those bad things. Okay. You, you're you're in the process of continuously healing those old childhood wounds and going back to those places, those hurt places, and everything from the past that is good is coming towards you, like the memories, like the lessons that you have learned, good, bad, and indifferent. So I'm not even going to say good there, but good, bad, and indifferent there with the lessons so you don't have to repeat those patterns. It's a lot of things that's coming towards you that you've been waiting for for quite a while, and it's definitely just absolutely amazing. What is this? We have the Queen of Pentacles. Yes, baby. You're definitely about to get um, financial blessings, right? Financial blessings because you are very financially responsible. You're very practical. You just are not just out here just, 
you know, you're you're but you're gonna be out here budgeting. You're gonna be out here doing what you need to do. Make a do how it. You go make a do what it need to do, right? You making a way. You're understanding that you need to follow your intuition. You're understanding that like what I have, I'm I'm gonna make the smart decisions, and then I'm also gonna make decisions like you only are living in this lifetime once, right? So um, you're also gonna make the decisions that hey um, this is this is what I'm gonna do because it makes me happy, right? You're focusing on things that make you happy and you're not worried so much as you were before because you're realizing it's going to work out in the end. It'll all end up working out no matter like the times in the past where you didn't feel like it was going to work out. You've learned a lot of lessons and you've grown a lot. We have the high priestess. You're following your intuition and as you follow your intuition, you're gaining a lot of wisdom. You know, like I was saying, a lot of things in the past, you're realizing that those lessons, those things that you had to go through were definitely for a reason, Okay. What do we have here? We have the motherfucking empress. That's exactly who you are. You are the empress. You're very stable. You're very down to earth. You're very grounded. And you know good and... Look at all this that fell out. You know good and darn well that it's been a lot of things that may have happened in the past, but you're very bright. You're very beautiful. You're very abundant. And it's just like you're living this luxurious life. You will begin to just hone in on everything that has happened in the past and just continue to live through this abundance. Okay. All of these are fell out. And I'm about to read them all. Okay. We have the world here. So there's something that high, high attainment that you've been trying to achieve for quite a while. And you're, you're definitely doing that, right? You're definitely doing that. You will be celebrating here with the Three of Cups. And there's something that um, you had to give up on. Five of Cups, there's something that you had to give up on. There's something that um, caused you pain in your life. Some people may have been like hurtful to you. Something caused you pain in your life. And then right after that, we have the King of Swords and the Five of Swords. Yeah. So there was somebody very deceitful in your life that hurt for you to have to move away from them. But you realize that the betrayals that they were doing, that all the things that they were doing, like having this competition with you that you ain't even know about, having um, like shitting on your name, talking behind your back, all of that, you knew that you couldn't win here. They were in a lower vibrational place and you ain't had no time for it. Like you, you, they were always petty, always trying to pick some type of argument with you. Um, they were always very irritable and you realized that you no longer wanted to be consumed with any of that energy, right? This person was very deceitful. We have the page of swords here and they didn't want you to see some things for how it was. So they tried to manipulate you. They tried to manipulate you, but they be. You could not be manipulated, but for so long because you opened up and you started having this spiritual awakening and you started separating yourself and any type of indecision, which is of the devil that you had, you realize that you had to be for yourself. If nobody else is going to be for you, you have to be for you yourself and you had to make a decision here with the lovers. There was a decision that you had to make and it caused strength, right? It caused you.